Imagine a life where the grip of poverty no longer stifles your dreams. Envision waking up each day without the weight of sadness and worry, free to pursue the life you've always desired. But what if I told you that within ancient tales and timeless wisdom lies a solution? An answer to the age-old question that has tormented humanity for centuries. How do we break free from the shackles of poverty? In this video, we embark on a journey guided by Zen stories and Buddhist insights to uncover an extraordinary revelation. Prepare to be captivated as we delve into an ancient ritual, one steeped in mysticism and promise, an initiation towards true prosperity. Brace yourself for an exploration beyond material wealth where happiness, love, and inner peace reign supreme. Stay tuned until the end. For within these teachings lies the key to unlocking a life of abundance and fulfillment. Welcome to our channel, Mindful Wisdom. Let's start the video. Step into the frosty morning shadows of an ancient Buddhist temple, where Monk Teo and his disciples await the dawn. Their souls troubled by a question as old as time itself. How do we rid ourselves of the suffocating grasp of poverty? It is here, amidst the crackling flames and lingering scent of green tea, that Monk Teo unveils the answer. A journey, not of external riches, but of inner abundance. With a calm voice resonating through the temple walls, Monk Teo introduces the disciples to an ancient ritual, one that transcends mere magic or superstition. It is, instead, a profound introspective journey toward discovering true wealth. As he unfurls a bag of scented cinnamon, the disciples lean in, intrigued by the promise of transformation that hangs heavy in the air. Cinnamon, Teo explains, is more than just a spice. It is a symbol of abundance and prosperity. Its warm, enveloping aroma carries with it the power to strengthen the body and purify the spirit, opening the mind to new possibilities. With these words, Teo invites the disciples to close their eyes, to let go of the burdens that weigh heavy upon their shoulders. In the dim light of flickering candles, the disciples breathe deeply, allowing the aroma of cinnamon to permeate their beings. They visualize the shadow of poverty, dense and oppressive, gradually dissolving in the warm embrace of the cinnamon-scented smoke. With each inhale and exhale, they release the chains of fear and doubt that bind them, embracing instead a sense of inner peace and confidence in the future. As the ritual draws to a close, Monk Teo bids the disciples to open their eyes. Their faces, once clouded with uncertainty, now glow with a newfound awareness. True wealth, Teo reminds them, resides not in material possessions, but in the depths of our souls. And with this realization, the disciples embark on a journey of transformation, a journey fueled by the warm, comforting embrace of cinnamon and the promise of true prosperity. In the days that follow, the disciples continue to practice the cinnamon ritual, savoring its benefits not only for the spirit, but also for the body. Cinnamon, with its anti-inflammatory, digestive, and antioxidant properties, becomes not just a symbol of inner abundance, but a catalyst for physical well-being as well. With each pinch of cinnamon burned, poverty becomes less a barrier than an opportunity for growth and evolution. The disciples learn to cultivate gratitude for the little they possess finding beauty and joy in the simplest of things. Their lives become a testament to the transformative power of inner wealth, a wealth measured not in material riches, but in love, compassion, and inner peace. Word of the cinnamon ritual spreads like wildfire beyond the confines of the ancient temple, reaching villages and cities far and wide. People from all walks of life are drawn to Monk Teo, eager to learn the secret to breaking free from the chains of poverty and finding true prosperity. With his enigmatic smile and compassionate soul, Teo welcomes all who seek guidance, offering them the ancient wisdom of the cinnamon ritual with open arms. What began as a simple practice within the temple walls soon evolves into a movement, a pilgrimage for those yearning for a better life, not just materially, but spiritually as well. The temple, once a place of solitary contemplation, now teems with life as people flock from near and far, their hearts brimming with hope and longing for change. Yet despite the influx of visitors, 
the ritual remains accessible to all. It requires no expensive items or special skills, just a pinch of cinnamon and a sincere desire for transformation. In homes, temples, and public squares alike, the scent of cinnamon mingles with the prayers and hopes of a people united in their quest for a more prosperous life. And as time passes, the benefits of the ritual become increasingly evident. Material poverty begins to decline, replaced by a newfound sense of inner wealth and abundance. Communities once divided by scarcity now find themselves bound together by compassion, generosity, and collaboration. The air buzzes with an energy previously unseen, as people come together to uplift one another and create a world where prosperity knows no bounds. Monk Teo, ever the wise sage, does not merely teach the ritual. He imparts a valuable life lesson. True wealth, he reminds his disciples, is not something to be possessed, but something to be cultivated from within. It is made up of priceless values, such as love, compassion, and inner peace, qualities that can never be bought or sold. The cinnamon ritual serves as a tangible reminder of this inner richness, a small talisman that connects people with the deepest essence of their being. It is a beacon of hope in a world too often overshadowed by greed and materialism, guiding people towards a life of meaning and purpose. And so, the cinnamon ritual continues to be passed down from generation to generation, an ancient wisdom that illuminates the path to true prosperity. It is an invitation, a call to action for all who seek to cultivate inner wealth and create a more harmonious and compassionate world. For in the warm embrace of cinnamon lies the key to unlocking a life filled with abundance, joy, and fulfillment. As Monk Teo reflects on the profound impact of the cinnamon ritual, he imparts a final lesson to his disciples, a lesson that transcends the boundaries of material wealth and delves into the depths of the human spirit. True wealth, Teo teaches, is not merely measured in the coins we possess or the possessions we acquire. It is found within the recesses of our souls, cultivated through love, compassion, and gratitude. In practicing the cinnamon ritual, disciples come to understand that true prosperity stems from an inner richness a richness that cannot be bought or sold, but must be nurtured and cherished. But the lessons of true wealth extend far beyond the confines of individual growth. They have ripple effects that resonate throughout communities and beyond. When individuals cultivate inner abundance, they are better equipped to contribute positively to the world around them. They become beacons of light in a world too often shrouded in darkness inspiring others to embark on their own journeys of self-discovery and transformation. Indeed, the cinnamon ritual serves as a powerful reminder of the interconnectedness of all beings and the importance of living in harmony with ourselves and with creation. It is a call to action, an invitation to embrace a life filled with meaning and purpose, grounded in the values of love, compassion, and inner peace. As the fragrance of cinnamon continues to waft through the air, mingling with the hopes and dreams of all who encounter it, it serves as a symbol of hope and renewal. It is a testament to the enduring power of the human spirit, a spirit that, when nourished and cherished, has the capacity to transcend even the greatest of obstacles. And so, as we bid farewell to Monk Teo and his disciples, let us carry with us the timeless wisdom of the cinnamon ritual. Let us nurture the flame of awareness within us, opening our hearts to love, compassion, and gratitude. And let us, in doing so, pave the way for a world where true prosperity knows no bounds, a world where abundance, joy, and fulfillment are accessible to all. In conclusion, the cinnamon ritual stands as a timeless testament to the power of inner wealth and the transformative potential within each of us as we journey through life. May we remember the lessons learned from Monk Teo and his disciples to cultivate gratitude, recognize abundance, and live authentically in harmony with ourselves and with creation. Let us embrace the warm embrace of cinnamon as a symbol of hope and renewal, guiding us towards a life filled with abundance, joy, and fulfillment.